you're sitting there on the front porch of your house and you brought out the book, just brought a new book, or, or just you're reading this book on your front porch. You're looking at it and you're reading, oh, okay, that's that's interesting. The first few sentences. And then when you flip the page and you come back to reality, you ask yourself, what the fuck did I just read? <laughs> you look back on the previous page and it's like, oh, I read this shit. <laughs> I read this shit. <laughs> and <laughs> this is a problem that I've had in in the past, my inability to focus, to uh, perform well, and just pay attention in class. So this applies to be an entrepreneur as well. So if you're an entrepreneur and you're optimizing and your number one priority is business or anything that involves this, a sharp mind, like, I don't know, some science, some scientific uh, research or whatever it is, then this way of eating could potentially help sky, help you skyrocket your performance in business and could get uh, and could help you deliver your result faster. Well, it, it did it for me certainly. I, I felt like it was a night and day differences. So I was having a lot of brain fogs when I was eating you know, the typical whole food diet, whole grains, whole, whole, whole rice, <laughs> whole wheat, whole bread, everything. And, but I was still having brain fogs. I was eating healthy, but I was having brain fogs. I started to look, in, I started to look into it and it was like, oh, it's because I'm eating carbs. It's because I'm eating sugar. And back then, I was prioritizing my uh, my health, my athleticism, my gym, my training. Um, so I didn't give a fuck back then, worry about that. But now, lately, it's just been kicking my ass. Uh, three months ago, it kicked my ass, and I was just so tired of the carb crash and everything. And I was starting to get into business, so I was like, I need to find a way to focus. In, in order to focus on my work when I'm when I'm doing my work so this is what I found have helped me to optimize for my best uh, performance as an entrepreneur when I'm working hey guys welcome to the channel my name is Coltrane and I'm a young man of self-improvement my goal here is to gather a group of young men together so that we can all grow and become better together and learn from each other man so, if you guys are anything like me, please subscribe, like, share, and comment below. And yeah, if there's anything that I miss in this video, or if there's anything that you guys think is wrong, please let me know. Also, I have a one-on-one -on -one diet coaching program uh, in the description below. There's a link in uh, the description below, and you guys can click that to book a call with me to see if we are compatible. And thank you guys for... Uh, for watching and joining me today so let's get started with the, let's continue with the video even though even though i was eating a very healthy diet uh as those around me would call it and even i would call it back then i was getting a lot of fucking name brand fox i was having whole on rice after rice after rice um i, I didn't have much meat in my in my meals not much fat not a lot of vegetables and I, I I got sold. I bought into the uh, I brought into the lie that eating fat is bad for you. I brought I, I was brought into the lie that eating meat is bad for you. I was and I, I was brought into the lie that eating rice, eating carbs that your most of your meal calories calories should come from carbs. I was wrong. <laughs> I was wrong. Um. And then I start looking up uh, things on YouTube, how to stop having carb crash, best diet for an athlete, best diet for an entrepreneur, and everything like that. And after, after like probably a half a month, half a month, three fourths of a month, eight months of just looking things up and just sitting there in my fucking crusty, musty chair, I, I think I found the solution. 
if you are, if your number and again if your number one priority is business or anything that involves a sharp mind I recommend you guys eating just just meat eggs salt and water just like that the carnival diet basically it's a carnival diet uh, right now I'm not fully optimizing for business because I'm currently optimizing and maximizing my potential for boxing but so I do need so I do eat a little bit of carbs in there but if you guys are optimizing for business or he overall health longevity I would recommend you guys this all right for business for business this is for business for entrepreneurs eat just meat eggs what salt and water that's it that's all you need and if you eat like that you pro and you probably just need to eat eat it for once a day if you don't train if you do train then you're probably gonna eat twice a day that's fine um and this this is what I found have helped me uh, perform so much better when it comes to business uh, when it comes to doing my work like right now that I'm doing uh, it's just going to help you a lot man it is going to help you a lot yeah sure I may have done business work while eating an athlete's diet yeah sure but because of that I switched to the keto carnival diet and that helped me tremendously even though I was still having some avocados some fruits some bananas some apple blueberries some honey and dairy I was still able to focus and do it's, it's a night and day difference I'm telling you it's a night and day difference um, so I recommend you guys checking that out and also one bonus tip that I would like to give you guys is I also recommend you guys fasting in the morning when you're doing your work until your normal lunch time if you eat three times a day before before this uh, if you have eat um, if you have eat three times a day previously um, then I recommend and and then now you want to change and optimize for business for work and everything I would recommend you guys fasting in the morning and then eating and then eating your first meal at lunchtime and then you eat one more at night if you choose to of course um, but yeah that's that's all I have for you guys today um, it's not it's not much it's real simple but sometimes it's hard to um, it, I, I, I fucking I fucked up on my diet before uh, but yeah if you are really optimizing for business I recommend you guys eating this with um, and this is not this is how we're supposed to eat anyways as humans and if you guys want to check that out more, go check out some other videos uh, on my channel about diet and everything. And you guys will, will, will kind of understand a little bit more. But this is the best. This, stuff, But this is what an entrepreneur should be eating in order to optimize for his performance, for his result in business and work. And that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. See you guys.